yeah, frustrated by getting negative after negative pregnancy result. There could be a lot of reasons why you're not pregnant yet, but rather than address the many doctors are taking the easy way out and simply recommending IVF. In this video, I'm gonna share with you the three key fertility factors that your doctor may be ignoring that'll increase your chances of getting pregnant naturally. Hi, I'm Alex Perry, director of the Perry Fertility Center. And I've helped hundreds of women just like you to start and grow their families. If you'd like to discover how to maximize your chances of conceiving naturally, click the link below now. You probably wanted to be a mum for a long time. Your mother was such an amazing woman and you aspire to be like her and you always dreamt of raising little ones of your very own. You're more ready than ever to welcome a baby into your house. So I imagine it's a bit of a shock when it feels like your body isn't ready. Maybe you've been trying for a while, but every month just ends in a negative pregnancy test and tears. Though it shouldn't be as hard as this feeling start creeping into your head. You might have even talked to a doctor about it, but been left in the dark after being told to just keep trying, or worse, suggesting IVF, when that's the last thing that you want. Well, there are three key fertility factors your GP may have missed or ignored, but they're actually crucial when it comes to conceiving naturally. The first of these key fertility factors is timing. Now, I'm sure you've already tried tracking your cycle and probably having an app on your phone, but in my clinical experience, nine times out of 10 women I speak to have no real idea when they're actually ovulating. And frankly, the app just does not know. Now, if you're falling pregnant easily, this is not your issue. But if you're not getting pregnant, maybe it's a part of the reason. If you can't answer the if and the when questions of ovulation, then you may well be playing Russian roulette with your fertility. And that's why timing is the very first key fertility factor that we look at. And with our unique front to back ovulation method, I'm gonna answer the if and the when question for you, giving you the confidence to know that you will never miss your fertile window again. This is massive. The second key fertility factor is actually a bunch of what we call ignored fertility factors or ifs for short. Now these are things that in my experience can lower your chances of getting pregnant naturally, but which GPs and even specialists often overlook. There are actually over a hundred ifs that could be impacting your fertility. And missing any one of these can reduce your chances of getting pregnant naturally. Now, when we have our initial conversation, I'm gonna identify your ifs and show you what to do about them. The third key fertility factor is your man. Making a baby is a two player game and there are six additional male fertility factors or myths for short that may be affecting your man's ability to get you pregnant naturally. Now, during our initial conversation, we're gonna identify which myths are affecting him and how to fix them. Ignore your man's myths at your peril. They can be a significant block to you getting pregnant naturally. As you can see, falling pregnant naturally is possible. You can see just a handful of our many success stories on the wall behind me, but every woman is different. Your needs are complex and what works for one woman may not work for another. If you'd like to discover how to maximize your chances of conceiving naturally, click the link below and start on a journey that has helped hundreds of women fall pregnant naturally. Women, just like you.